Welcome back to the Inner Bark Outdoors channel where we do videos on the outdoors, survival, do-it-yourself, and reviews. And this video is in response to a lot of requests on the handcuff knot and also the fireman's chair knot. We'll start with the handcuff knot because the other one plays on this one. The handcuff knot is great for making a makeshift hobble, pulling a deer out of a ravine, or just for fun. We'll start in the middle of the line and we'll form two identical loops, just like we're making a clove hitch. And just like the clove hitch, we'll place the second loop over the first loop. Now here's the most complicated step of the whole process. You'll pass the second loop through the first loop and vice versa. And there you have it, you have yourself a handcuff knot. If you pull on the working end and the standing end, the loops will get smaller. And if you pull on the loops, it'll get bigger. Pretty simple. Now let's go into the fireman's chair knot. The fireman's chair knot is a really quick way to make a makeshift harness. It's a mutation from the handcuff knot, and this makes it so that the loops actually lock in place and they don't get bigger or get smaller once you have it tied. So we'll go ahead and make the handcuff knot as our base. We'll make two identical loops, pass the second one over the first one, and then pass each loop through the opposite loop. So the way that this locks is it uses two half hitches, one on each end. You can do this by either forming a bite and twisting it and then passing the loop through. Or if you have access to the end of the line, you can take it and just string it all the way through to form your half hitch. Now when you pull on the loops, they don't get bigger or they don't get smaller. Um, if you pull on the working end or the standing end, also the loops will stay put. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please like, share, and subscribe, and also check out my other knot tying videos. If you guys have any suggestions for other knots, go ahead and leave it down in the comments. But as always, take care out there. Bye.